create the Shopify store. And I know what some of you guys are thinking that are watching this video. How can you make a store? How can you do this all with no money when Shopify costs 29 bucks a month? Shopify has a free trial. And the free trial is currently 14 days. So I have 14 days to make money with the store until I am charged. And the quick and easy and simple trick to do this is after I create the store, I'll then pick a plan. Then I'll enter my credit card information, but I will not be charged until after the 14. Hi guys, so it's your girl Lux Tyra here back again with another video. So if you've seen the clip that I played in before this, I will be teaching you guys how to be starting the dropship. So basically, like he said, with Spotify, and this was June 19. I'm not for sure if they still have this going on, but I want to know until later until I get back to the room. And then I would just go along with that then. But basically, I'm gonna teach you guys, I'm gonna tell you guys the strategy of dropshipping. My phone is sitting up on my computer. So basically with dropship, my computer is like on 7% anyways. I got to connect to hotspot because I'm at the public storage right now, you know. So hotspot is working good. Phone is like on 35%. But anyways, let's get into this. Hold on. So I can speak on behalf of Shopify. I never worked with them for as like putting my business out there or anything like that. But this is going to be like a business tip plus how to do drop shopping video. I have my tea right here because I am currently thirsty and <laughs> anyways, so with drop shipping and like starting a business, I say it's best that like every entrepreneur that you know, like made by REJ, Bougie Babe, um, any entrepreneurs that else that you can think of, they use Shopify. They don't use Big Cartel. Big Cartel do more like webinars and tips on how to start a business and what you should do for your business. I can't vouch for that because my business is with Big Cartel. But with Shopify, they actually like give you customers, um, help you promote your stuff, and like just kind of put your name out there for its business wise. So that's what another thing I like about them. There is more to the expensive side, like maybe 20, 50, not 20, but like 50 to 75 dollars. So when I first started my business, I was looking at it. But hey, I was on a budget and I was starting my business, so I went over to Big Cartel. I did do successful with that, I can say, but my site is no longer up because I'll be transferring over to Shopify. Do not not Big Cartel. Do not. I would say for any small entrepreneur, go with Big Cartel if you don't have the funds right now if you have the funds i say at least like five to ten bands yeah go ahead and sh do shopify but if you want to do big cartel because that's your preference i recommend it at all times so with that being said let's get into talking about drop shipping so with drop shipping that's something i will begin currently into and i'll show you guys like throughout the whole entire week and like he said you have 14 days and to accumulate your money and just promote yourself so me i have a i have a following slash engagement on pinterest which is at this right here 14 i mean i've been past 14 it's at 414k viewers a month and normally for me i get like 33k viewers every overnight so i'm not bragging on boston in any type of way but i do get like 33 at least i think my least amount is might be 10k overnight so yeah um, I will promote business on there and I do promote small businesses on there. So like, if you guys need business promotions, please email me or just DM me in the comments or DM me on Instagram down below. Tell me if you want me to promote your business on my Pinterest because I do have views and stuff on there, which I leave a slide video on the slide. Anyways, let's get into drop shipping. Drop shipping. One, you take any pictures off the internet, basically like what I do for my vendors list. You take a picture off the internet, contact the person, making sure they contact you back. The prices and everything else is straight shipping. So when you take their pictures off their website, you copy and paste it into the Shopify. So that's one. You copy and paste the, um, i leave all the tips on the side. You copy and paste their website pictures to your um, website. Two, once somebody actually do get on there because they will... You put your price so you can make your money and you get the vendor's price. So basically what you do is somebody say, okay, for this um, designer Gucci Rumpfer, it's $25 plus shipping $30. You'll probably want to charge that person $50 to $60 so you can get your cut. So in that way, you will still be accumulating maybe $30 a day depending on how many people that you get. Not $30 a day, but like if you get three people, that's $90. So basically, I say $100 a day. $100 a day, if you're doing a weekend too, because people shop on the weekends, that's when they off. That's $700 a week. So basically, just think, $700 a week times those 14 days, 
which is two weeks, that's $1,400. So basically that's $100 a day. That's $1,400 that you have right there in the bank and you can start your ship, your membership over. So basically you keep doing that over and over. So how are we going to get to it? You do not touch the product at all unless you want to. Like say for instance, this Jordan shirt I have on right here. Okay, so this is a Nike shirt. Got it from a Nike outlet. I'd be like, oh yeah, y'all, it's great quality. You see, it never faded. I watched this shirt over maybe 10 times because I wore it that much. It never faded. The material's still good. It never stretched, never did anything. So me promoting this product on my platforms and stuff is going to make somebody else be like, well, dang, I want that shirt. It's cute. You know, it's simple, but we can spice it up. Bet they want this shirt. This shirt, $17 from the vendor. You charge them. You ain't got to overcharge them. You can just charge $25, $30. Bet. It's name brand, so they're going to want it. So you get your money. You send it over to the vendor. Give the vendor the address. And they'll send it to the person. So basically, you do not touch the products at all unless you buy it for yourself. That's another thing. You can do designer purses. So like this YSL purse right here. I can take this same purse and sell it for $350. In reality, this purse might be $3,500. Okay. So I take this purse seller for 350. I'm probably getting it for the vendor for 75. That's including shipping. That's money in your pocket. So if y'all get what I'm saying, y'all catching the drift, that is some money that you can make during um quarantine. And the reason why I say that it's not like you're scamming, it's not like you're doing fraud, it's not like you it's not like you're doing anything like that. Basically, only thing that you need to know is that the quality is good, and the person gonna shop again and is this something that they're willing to do so basically that's what that's all i'm saying um another business idea is always promote your stuff when you um send out their products and stuff just be like oh next time you come you get a discount code for this dollars uh, like ten dollars off five dollars off two dollars off or whatever else with me like for lashes and stuff whenever i do lashes i basically like to do okay if you buy a pack of lashes you probably get a hairpin or a lip gloss because one i'm getting ready to restock in my lip gloss two i'm trying to get rid of it but not get rid of it and still make my money off of it so i'm trying to give you one but if you want to go back and buy more you can that's perfect that means i'm still making my money because they like this one product so they're going to come back and buy more if y'all catch my drip good um another thing make sure you always have sales each day not each day i'm sorry make sure you always have coupon codes at the checkout make sure you um give away like free items it can be something simple because like if you go on aliexpress you can get hair pants for 12 cents and you're giving that away you want to be mad over a dime and two pennies why would i switch out my dime for a penny like be for real so if y'all are catching what i'm saying just keep flowing and make sure you subscribe because i'm teaching y'all how to get money okay okay but yeah um i don't know if my computer went dead i should have had notes up right here anyways it's on like six percent so he put i tried drop shipping with no money for a week the reason why he said for a week because he started within that week when they actually gave him two weeks so during that time i don't know how much he sell his products for so in reality if we go with designer things which catch girls attention men attention and stuff like that we could normally sell that for at least bank like 30 like 350 dollars 450 dollars so they're gonna be like oh child that's that Louis Vuitton purse that cardi b had in the video okay oh shoot sacrifice mm -mm. that price mm -mm. well okay i've seen this girl had the same authentic bag and she sell it for like 350 right about now i got the money for it and i want to spend this bag on the bag period sis get this bag are you getting yours i'm getting in mine okay like this is all ways that we all can make money during quarantine you can be any age you can be three five seven ten twelve like it doesn't matter it's just like how you promote your business at the end of the day when you promote it if you're constant in promoting consistently promoting just stuff like that never get a business and then fail that's something that we don't want to do do because on like behalf of me yes i did sit down my business for a while but i'm restarting it next month so that's all i'm saying i'll talk to y'all when i get back to the room okay y'all don't come over here acting silly because this is a business video so I got my holy moly chipotle double chicken double steak. I, what I just told you, don't do that. <laughs> I got my holy moly chipotle chicken and double steak. 
No, I'm trying to teach people how to make money. So if you want to eat at Chipotle every day, I'm playing. But if y'all want to eat at, shut up. Say something else. Y'all, baby J gonna get hurt. I would have cried. My Chipotle would have filled. But if y'all want to ring what I got before I start digging into it, I got white rice, double chicken, double steak, extra sour cream, extra cheese. And you just drizzle your vinaigrette meat sauce on it. But anyways, I had came up with more ideas, but I don't remember what it was. Um, so basically... I think I stopped off of giving free items. So, <coughs> you will always want to give out free items or something for them to shop again, like a discount code and a thank you card. Make your package look cute. So, yeah. And then you just take your money since you don't have to do anything like for shipping or whatever else take your money and just save it oh and i was about to say make sure y'all try to go with brand deals like fashion nova clothes type um louis vuitton um fendi prada gucci coach try to do things like that And if you don't feel comfortable doing that, you can just do other stuff. It really doesn't matter. There's so many ways where you guys can just make money off of anything. You can literally make money off of socks. Like, anything. You can make money off of lighters. You can sell a lighter for $5. Oh, Light bulbs, <laughs> even though I'm dating one, I don't like them. I'm playing, y'all. So, yeah, so if y'all want a part two to this video of when I start drop shipping, make sure y'all subscribe, like, comment, and um, share this video if you want to start your own business, okay. Period.